Hello! I'm Mabel McDove and tonight's ghost story is in Scotland. It's in 1878 with a Reverend Charles who apparently had an orphanage. Orphanages are always creepy. That's why they make so many horror movies about them. And nine times out of ten there's a freaky little ghost kid. But tonight is a different ghost story. Three kids whose mother died, were brought in. Now, these three kids all slept with the other kids in a great big room. And Reverend Charles slept in the next room over. But one night, he decided to sleep in an extra bed in with the kids, just to keep an eye on them. You know how kids are. They like to get up and play at night. So he was sleeping, and around 11 p.m., that night, he woke up. Something told him to wake up. He looked around the room, and all of a sudden, he sees a light, like a cloud of light, almost in the shape of a halo. It was about five feet high, and it lasted about five minutes. And it hovered around one of the children. I think it was the youngest one. And it just hovered there. And he didn't say anything. And he didn't wake the child. But the next morning, the child came to him and he said that he saw his mother last night. And that happened in 1878. But in 1883, a story was printed in a magazine. And the kid, the youngest child, who had grown up, knew that it was about him. So he contacted the Reverend Charles, and he asked him why he had never told him that he saw the mother. And he didn't have an explanation because he couldn't comprehend what was going on. But he said that he had seen something that night, but he didn't realize that the boy was awake or if he was dreaming that he saw his mother because there had been accounts of this happening before so that's a ghost story for you kind of a little switch on the orphanage thing I mean dead moms dead kids everything dies <laughs>